now. Why does that sound like you're not coming with us? These are my people. Some still survive if I stay. Then we'll stay and help. Go. I'll be where I'm needed when I need to be. Just trust me. Don't go dying on me. I'm starting to actually get you. Papa Squat Golden Boy, you're making me nervous. Or perhaps your nerves need gnawing. What did I do? This precarious plan proves more meek by the moment. The Madonna was meant to be among us. She knows what she's doing. Eventually. What sorry sins I have wrought to rest me among such a motley crew. Did he? Did he take my room? Not so much as a yip from the mud. Groot says he'll keep trying. Where's Mr. Fancy Words? It is assumed Peter Quill's quarters. It was a daring display of dominance. Don't you start. Usually I'd say who needs him, but we do. So you better fix this one, Quill. Just try not to piss him off any more than he already is. If it is to be a fight to the death, I will honor the outcome. If he kills you, I get your guns. bet on Peter winning that fight. It took all five of us to beat him last time. I still can't believe he caught one of my smart bombs. Just like that. We have already fought the man. Hold on. You don't remember? I remember sparring against the Celestial Madonna in a small village. And in the cold darkness of the promise devouring my soul. Until you found me. Yeah, you missed a lot. Hey, Warlock, open up. This is my room, you know. And that would be my cassette cover. You pen this pithy poetry? It's not poetry, it's music. Hard rock. It's supposed to have guitars and bass and drums. Simplistic scriptures, as is its scribe. Okay, what's your deal, man? What did I do to piss you off? Your lamentable leadership allowed the Madonna to leave when we needed her talents to travel to the telepathic realm. Mantis had good reason to stay behind. We just need to get Nikki and get the hell out so we can find her again. Your tenuous tactics trust too much to fortune. Can you confidently convince me your meager measures may amply manage this mission? Yes. Absolutely. Wise words. Sure and measured. But beheld by my bemused misgivings, your demeanor differs distinctly in direction from my more willful ways. Maybe we can meet in the middle then. Yes. An oath! Will you own an oath to operate with greater aggression? To give gravitas to gravid seasons of your soul and struggle not to stand on destiny's icy flows? Sure, man. Whatever it takes. Then assert it. I swear I'll be a good leader. That I'll be decisive and, and uh, that I won't let Manus do whatever she wants. I stand partially reassured. What about you, Mr. Fancy Words? How do I know you won't see Raker and have a change of heart? Why would I weasel away? Didn't you used to be best buds with him? We were common company for a fleeting fallow, through which I witnessed the incommensurable extent of his sadness. He mourns his lost son. That's why he's doing all of this. The church, the matriarch, because he wants to get his kid back. 
But that can't happen, right? Megas can't... No. Cannot. So? We can count on you? When you reunite with Raker, that man's gotta go down. Indubitably. Rodent. You mentioned the Madonna riding my shoulders through the caves. So, how is he? Frustrating. It's like talking to Suzanne Harris at the summer dance all over again. Ain't that the Humi girl you tried to impress with your yo-yo skills? Yeah, and it went about as well as talking to Mr. Cape. What's a yo-yo? You reach Cosmo? It may be up to us to stop the church in nowhere. You ready? I am Groot. He's worried about the mutt. Says it would be easier with his help. I didn't think Cosmo would let the church take over his station. But if they got the Cortex, then... He is but one canine against the army of the Converted. explains why we ain't been able to reach Cosmo. If you don't answer it, they'll vaporize us. I will handle this communication. All yours, buddy. Deceased wife and daughter are with me to thank the matriarch for her gift. May the promise be fulfilled. You are clear to land at the spaceport. Regiments, while we wait, whistling in the wings. Landing as fast as I can, Gold. What the flark? Great, cocoon boy thinks he's a butterfly now. He is a man of action. Let's just hope that he can keep the church busy while we look for Nikki. Didn't think you'd be able to bluff your way through security muscles. I am quite adept at deception. We're gonna need more than that to get to the Continuum Cortex and rescue Nikki. Especially with Golden Boy jumping ship. Should we, like, try to find him? Time is running out. We cannot lose focus if we are to save the girl. Drax is right. Let's just hope Warlock can do a bit of damage on his side. Let's do this! Time to save Nikki! Peter? Okay... Just be cool. Let me handle these guys. Welcome, travelers. Have you come to witness the fulfillment? What now? The realization of the Matriarch's promise. The beginning of a new world. One without death, or pain, or fear. You should know this. Weren't you vetted and clear to land here? What? Of course we were. How are you not aware of the fulfillment? Something is wrong. These heretics must be stopped! Attack! Come on, what a fool! Come on, Adam, big guy! 
die. The blockhead amping up his bodies. Out. I will comply. Look, we need to move if you want to find me. Yeah, Quill's just doing some uh, preparation work, I guess. Well, we should prepare faster. Find the girl. We sever her connection with Magus. We don't. If Cocoon Boy ain't around to suck it up afterward, we'll just have to reason with her. Scott! Cosmos Tower's shut down. That's because it's never been dark before. You do realize some of the guys shooting at us were nowhere security? This does not bode well for the dog. Never was the Mutt's biggest fan, but we could have used the backup telepath. If Cosmo is on their side, getting to the Cortex could be a lot harder. Just because the tower shut down doesn't mean Cosmo is too. Last time we were here, he knocked out me, Gamora, and Drax, and Lady Hellbender's bounty hunters, like it was nothing. We just gotta have faith he's okay. Really, Peter? Faith? There does appear to be an excess in the story here. see in the marketplace. The same thing we saw when we flew in. Yeah, but it'll be up close. Nowhere really stunk sometimes, but... Clark! Over there! There's so many of them. I thought most nobodies would have rejected the promise. Everyone wants something they can't have. Yeah, but... Yeah, I don't know, Rocket. Like Gamora said, everybody wants something. The church tailors their offer to the individual. Seems to me most of them would give in. Or they'd be killed. Not an easy choice. We've got Clark and Faith batteries everywhere. Just like on Hal's Hope. Perhaps they have built another giant ray gun inside the Continuum Cortex. To siphon Faith from multiple worlds at once? 
Is that even possible? The energy ain't filling these batteries. It's moving away from me. So we're powering something. Sure looks like it. Uh, don't suppose we could try tricking them again? Make them believe we're all promised up? Not unless you can fake that purple glow they all seem to have. Wonder if any of these fortune tellers saw this coming. Unlikely. They were all charlatans. Most of them were pickpockets and fences. Pretty useful people to know. Shh. Try not to give ourselves away. to the fulfillment. The priest said that they were bringing... They can't raise the dead, especially after we save Nikki. Ah. I had a contact here, rotations ago. You did? Was it Blurf? No, no, no. Shut up and... Butts, maybe? Whoa, 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 whoa. Cat free. He always gave Groot the creeps. My Groot. done here, we will need to tell a Rhapsodus about these adventures. A what? They are the keepers of Katathian lore. This will be an epic tale. <sighs> I'm surprised the church was able to seize the Cortex. Secure last time. Eh, wasn't half as secure as the dog thought. The church's forces increased by the tick. Their superior numbers could have easily breached the defenses. Well, we got just the five of us. Filling us all with confidence there. A big guy. Warlock said. Which part? He hasn't stopped talking since we met him. About how Nikki and that Magus thing might be too intertwined to save her. Over here! Looks like we can squeeze through. We must be close to Mantlo's bar. Can you see it? Not really. There's a lot of debris in the way. There is no way through this wall. Could be a bunch of wackos just waiting for us on the other side. Good point. Peter, you should find a way over to check. What? Whoa! Well, that didn't work. Clark, I'm going in. What about the fanatics? I'll toast them if I see them. We're the only ones who can do this, right? Clear back here, Quill. Looks like you're gonna have to yank a chunk free from this side, though. If I can find a way over there, I think you can anchor to this wall. Gamora, you should be able to get your sword in there now. Give me a boost. Let's hope it holds. Oh, Scott! Not Mantlos. Look at her! 
This is personal, Quill. Don't when we are done hanging. here, we will need to tell a Rhapsodist about these adventures. A what? They are the keepers of Katathian lore. This will be an epic tale. no sign of Goldie Braun since he left from our ship. Adam Warlock. Might be splattered somewhere across the lower city. Or got picked up by a wandering creep squad. Or maybe he was lying about which side he was on. He was just waiting to attack. The Warlock carries an old grudge. But not align himself with the Grand Unifier. Yeah, what do we need the Golden Boy for anyways? We were doing fine without him. I was not fine. Magus was devouring my soul. Your memory is suspect. Warlock's stronger than any of us. And he's got a pretty good reason to hate Raker. So you buy his ripped my soul in two story. Just saying, if anybody stands a chance going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Raker, it's him. And we're gonna need the Grand Unifier out of the way if we want to stop this ritual. Throw the meat into the meat grinder to keep it busy. That's not what I... No! I'm on board now, Quill. It's a solid strategy. Okay, we got this. Whoa. The Emporium used to be right here. Did the church destroy it? Doubt it. The Collector probably blasted out of here at the first sign of trouble. Before the first sign. They put up a fight. A valiant effort in the face of certain defeat. Looks like the church is trying to keep us out of there. That's not gonna work. Careful, Peter Quill. Guys, look down. It's an awful lot of light. You're thinking it's the full Flarkman, ain't you? But it could just be runoff from the cables. Whatever these whack jobs are up to, they need a lot of juice. Perhaps this is how they powered their fleet to reach Lamentus. Nikki had Warlock's Soul Stone in her hand. What if it's fused there and Raker's trying to remove it? <laughs> like he did with Goldilocks? Didn't work all that well the first time. The girl may have sensed the evil in the stone and insisted they try again. Or she's outlived her usefulness and Raker wants the stone's power for himself. Regardless, we must reach the Undercity to find the girl and stop her. We'll have to be ready for them to try and stop us. That's not the way to Cosmos. Might be something down there we can use. Groot. Ah. <sighs> Seedy underbelly, seedy underbelly. You know, they used to run a poacher's ring out of here. Is that what that smell was? Yep. Rotting beasts from Maclu 4. Was really hoping there'd be hover bikes down here. Why would there be? No outrageous parking fees, for one. And two, sometimes you want to drop something off without anyone else seeing it. Looks like there's a console on the other side. Might be able to use it to cut the power. Get me over there, and I'll see what I can do. Can you squeeze in there? Yep. Let's see where it goes. So if there were hover bikes down here? We could have hopped on and zipped down to the lower city. Me and Groot used to do it all the time. There you go. Should be safe. Should be. Thank Flark these boots are waterproof. Dead end. And let's continue before Nikki becomes a dead end, too. Our level of cooperation is invigorating. We've become a formidable team. Yep, sure have, Drax. Ain't we just one big, happy flark and family? What are you doing? 
doing with that garbage? She's not garbage. Good. Gamora, wait, hold on a sec. Why? Some more children can be sacrificed in the name of Rager's flarked up church. No, of course not. Just Just what, Peter? I don't know. Breathe. Every minute we waste. We don't have time to breathe. I know Raker brings back bad memories. This isn't about Thanos. It's about Nikki. And what men like Raker and Thanos do to girls like her. Like me. My sister. If I had just been better at protecting Nebula, maybe... Maybe she wouldn't be dead. Whoa. What? Nebula's dead? How? By who? Tell me, so I can find him and shake his protecting hand. By me. You killed your sister? She is the one you saw in the Matriarch's Promise. That's how I knew it was a lie. 
the nebula I knew had been twisted into a hateful, vengeful monster thing. One who would never stop unless I stopped her. So I did. I just never expected to survive. Why didn't you say something? It's not exactly a conversation starter. Hi, I'm Gamora. I murdered my sister. Can we be friends? Of course we can't. How can you be friends with a monster? Why would you want that on your team? A team I actually... kind of enjoyed being on. All things considered. Well, uh, I hate Nebula, so I actually would have... What? I'm just saying it don't change nothing. Actually, it changes everything. The most deadly woman in the galaxy just admitted... She loves us. <laughs> I did not. You did? You said you were in love with us right after the part about killing your sister. I said I enjoyed your company. That is the Katathian definition of love. Like. I I'll give you like. C can we just move on? Agreed. That's about all the love fest I can take. We accept you, Gamora Zenubri. Pretty sure we're married now. This is excruciating. All right, I'm pretty sure we've all caught our breath. Let's say we go stop a nutjob cult leader. Yes! Incoming! Throw that, Drax! These fanatics only understand violence!
reserve forces they can bring in here. We gotta shut it down! Let's get to the bridge. Cosmos Tower is the quickest way. Too wide to cross. Maybe we can bridge the gap. We keep saying bridge, and it's starting to sound like a made-up word. All words are made up. Drax? I have been eager to topple something over. So, Gamora? How am I supposed to drop the most interesting thing she's ever done? Really? A fate force field? If we can find the power source, we should be able to turn it off. Let's get looking then. That's it, Peter! Let's go! We need to get out of here before Raker shows up. Alright, dead ahead! Let's book it! I'll be <laughs> Guardians of the galaxy. The Matriarch has chosen to enact the fulfillment from this station. And you shall not stop her. She hasn't chosen anything. You've been manipulating her from the start. She is the light. And I am merely her servant. Kinda hard to be the light with that dark monster thingy inside of her. Blasphemy! You may have rejected her. But you will believe when it returns you from death's cold clutches. Your pain has pushed you to a perilous precipice, old friend. I saw you die. The form is fleeting, but the foundation remains forever. Now cease this stubborn senselessness before it reaps a ruinous reward. Ruinous. We're 
approach the dog's tower! Hold on, Nikki! We're coming! This'll work! We can leapfrog our way back onto the bridge! Leapfrog? It's a... Just follow my lead! This has got my name on it! Posterior, his champion cheeks. Huh. Perhaps we should summon the ship to deliver us to our destination. Ain't no way they'd let us land anywhere near the big party. Better off fighting our way there. Indeed. I would much rather face them with my blades.
Finally! I think they're giving up. Just in time, because we're not getting back on that bridge. I know where we are. There's a road nearby that intersects the main bridge to Cosmos. Where? It should be, uh, right below us. Warlock better not kill Raker before I get to him. I am eager to pull that sorcerer's insides to the outside. We need to be on the other side of this thing. We're not getting over. Would under suffice? Must suck to be a celestial head. Drax, buddy, let's make a hole. That's one way down. The best way. <sighs> Look! They're still at it! At least our guy seems to be winning. Ba -ba -ba -boom, baby! You sure are destroying a lot of advertising today. Like we need another reminder to buy Calex cream. What's so special about Goldie anyway? Yeah, he's strong. But what good is strong against ridiculous, unrelenting firepower? Could you stop a turbulent ocean with your bullets? Yes. One day we must test your theory. You gonna make us a bridge or what? <laughs> Who cares if he didn't ask? This ain't no time to be polite, you big stump. Battle must have been tremendous. Is any of this structurally sound? Oh, you gotta be farkin' kidding me. I am Groot. Uh, Groot thinks we'll be nowhere royalty once we save it. Assuming they don't blame us for the Grand Unicorn, and the brainwashing cult, and the Magus World Destroyer thing. You know what? Maybe we should avoid nowhere for a while. I don't suppose Groot knows another side route. If I could just get to the other side, I could hack that thing and drop the bridge. If you can get to the other side, we can get to the other side, and it wouldn't matter. <sighs> Throw me. What? Throw me! Just get muscles to huck me across. Do you have any idea how far down it is if you miss? We ain't got time to argue. I'll make it. Leave this to me! Whoa! Glad that wasn't rocket! You are a valued member of this team. Not a tool to be thrown about. Worried about this ritual. And what's really gonna happen if we can't stop it? Ain't gonna be dead people coming back, holding hands and wagging tails, that's for sure. We won't have to worry about that. I know I can get through to Nikki. This is Raker's doing, not hers. I won't give up on her either. Nor will I. Yeah, and neither will the Grand Unicorn. He will regret it. This carnage brings back troubling memories of worlds I destroyed. Always wondered, what did you use to do that? Some kind of mega bombs? Rocket! Blades. My own hands. And feet. Knees. Elbows. Often my forehead. 